check this thing out. This is a new thing um, that I uh, designed with another, uh, with a pickup maker. Dan Beaver um, helped me make this pickup. I call this a Galaxy Super Gear Shifter because it's got a gear shifter on it here. I know, it just looks like a five-way switch, right? But it's more than that uh, because this is not a five-way switch for the pickups. Um, well, it is, but not for both of them. This turns the pickups off and on here. So you got an off and on switch for your, um, oh, turn it back on. That's your on off for your bridge right there. And that's your on off for your neck there. So um, what this does, this is hooked up to the bridge pickup. It's a five way switch that's hooked up to a bridge pickup. And um, basically it's wound five times over. So um, first set of winding is, um, you know, the setting here. And it's um, a small amount of winding. So it's, um, you know, it writes it like, I don't know, 1.7, I didn't check it, it's very low. Then each time you bring it to the next setting, it gets higher. That's like 2.5, here it's like four or five or something, here is like eight or nine, and then here is like 11, it's like super overwound. So um, you're just going through different windings of the pickup as it gets to, as you move the switch across. So the winding is getting thicker and thicker each time you move this across. Um, you know, I've heard that, I've seen that done with um, two separate windings. Like uh, I had a Curtis, Curtis Novak pickup that went from P90 to Mose right. So you could switch to two different ones. And I thought, well, let's just go further. Let's take it to five. Let's see, let's go real underwound to real overwound. And um, I don't know, it looks cool. It's fun to play with. It has great sounds. And uh, I always wanted a pickup that could get different volume levels quickly rather than trying to find your volume level here and you're going like that and you're shutting yourself off to nothing in the middle of the song. Well here you can get different volume levels within the song. So real low here. And then right here full power here. changing the volume you're changing the number of winding number of winds on the pickup so you're changing the output of the pickup and that's a different sound and it's really fun it's really cool looking and um yeah it's really neat now it only works on this pickup this is just a, so this whole pickup is different it looks like a standard i mean it's like the, the pinto shape but then we uh put a black um cover in there so this guitar belongs to um ron swarden and he uh designed the look of it the pick our color um we decided to go with that plate that we've used in the past and uh two switches and then he wanted black and white pickups so um the coil inside there is very different from uh a depinto coil um and in order to get it to fit all the windings the magnets had to be uh neodymium i think they had to be like longer and that's all we could find that's all dan could find were these neodymium magnets and they sound very different from the the pinto pickup now the neck pickup uh, has a lot of beef already so it, um, it's just a loud pickup compared to this one so that's strange right that's uh that comes in at around i think seven and this is went on to like 11 or 13 and they're about the same <laughs> so we may have to go back to the drawing board and make this one um you know push even harder than that one so it's above it you know but um, I mean, there's, you know, things we can do to tweak it already. It's super neat and super fun. You know, I have an idea that it's the ferrite magnet in here that gives it so much push. And we not we might not be hearing more output. We may be hearing just the EQ um, shape of that magnet. It just has this, you know, mid range that pushes. And this one is very um, fender thin sounding. <laughs> That was the next pickup. Bridge. I mean, it's 
still had some push, you know? But I full power, it should be above that one, and it's it's about the same. <laughs> super awesome and fun um, and you know it's just a lot of things you can do with this with the tone <laughs> So that was just the first time I ever tried that. So pretty fun, pretty cool looking uh, new Galaxy that uh, we're messing around with with the new Super Shifter Switch. There you go.